This is a very short and to the point video of how to safely trim dog nails. I'm using the Dremel in this clip and you can see there is a bullseye, it's black, and then there's white around it and then there's the rest of the nail. And that's what you're looking for is the black center area, the white part around it, and then the rest of the nail around it. That is when you wanna stop. When you see that bullseye, you want to stop. That goes for the Dremel or the nail clippers. If you are working on a white nail, it will be a pinkish color. Um, the quick is a lot easier to see on white nails. This video is specifically for the black nails. A lot of people have requested this video because they don't know what to look for. So I wanted to show multiple nails so you can get a good picture of what to look for. So we have the black center, the white around it, and then the rest of the nail, which is black around it. It's the same when you're using nail clippers. That black spot in the middle is when you want to stop. Very, very slowly taking a little bit off at a time. That black spot in the middle. You can see it on all those nails. So now I'm just trimming out the paw pad hair, which helps prevent matting. It also increases traction on slippery floors so your dog is not slipping all over the place. And it also just makes the foot look a lot nicer. And when that hair is down in that paw pad, it can feel like the dog is walking on a rock. Like if we have a rock in our shoe, it's very uncomfortable. So you can see, just trimming this again, the dog's feet are dirty. This dog was a complete shave down. This video will be out uh, hopefully pretty soon, maybe in the next couple weeks or so. This is a sibling to Sunny. And then I'm gonna show you how I clean my clippers in between each and every dog. I use Clipper Side. It's a disinfectant, lubricant. It cools, it oils, it's everything. So I just spray the blade on my clippers while it's running and I use it very thoroughly, spraying the whole thing. I shake off the excess, which also shakes off any hair that may be on there. And then I take it off and I put it back and it's ready to go. Thanks for watching.